Hi, my name is our Reverend W.A. Watson. Welcome back to Motivational Monday. This is Life as We Know It. You can go ahead, subscribe, and click the bell so you can get all my notifications. Like, comment, and share. You know, um, in our everyday life, we are faced with challenges, right? And um, there are times we don't really know how to navigate through our difficult moments. Now, what if there was a solution to all our problem? Wouldn't you take it? What if we were able to take a tablet for discouragement? Wouldn't you? What if we were able to take a tablet for fear? Wouldn't you? Now this morning, I just want to encourage you all. There is a way to overcome all your situation. And you can find it in the word of God. And that comes through faith. Now, according to Hebrews chapter 11, verse 1, it says, No faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evident of things not seen. Now, there's a lot of things that are in our life that we really want to accomplish, but we have not seen them yet. And we have not even seen the substance to achieve them. And there are times we do get discouraged and we feel alone. And Hebrews chapter 11 has become a cliche to a lot of us. In other words, we have heard it so many times we really forget the importance of that scripture. It has lost its value. Look at it from a different perspective and speak a word over your life. A word of power. A word of healing. A word of victory. A word of deliverance. Just speak it over your life. If you're feeling fearful, Put your hand on yourself and say, I am no longer a slave to fear. And believe that with all your heart. If you're feeling down, put your hand on yourself and declare it. That I'm no longer discouraged. I'm no longer feeling down. Just declare it over your life. If you feel you need to be empowered, put your hand on yourself and say, I am powerful. I am beautiful. I am God creation. I was made by God in the image and in the likeness of God. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. And he formed man from the dust of the ground. We are a royal priesthood. Tell yourself that this morning. I am a royal priesthood. I am of a holy nation. Yes, somebody might speak evil against you that destroy your personality that messed up your mind and you no longer feel loved but this morning even though you feel like nobody loves you God loves you for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life a powerful verse but many a times we look over this verse not understanding that it was because of the great love of God while we are here because he sent his son his one son to die for our sin 
What an amazing God. See, you can talk about you don't love me. That's okay. Let them talk. Jesus love you first. Oh, you don't understand how it feels. We all have someone that doesn't like us. We're not perfect. Yeah, people out there don't like us, but that's all right. God loves us first. And because he loves us, we are going to have a blessed and a godly week. And we're going to speak life, love, and favor over our life. If you need favor in the job, speak it over your life. Wherever you go, speak the word over your life. There's life and death in the power of the tongue. God bless you. Bless someone this week by speaking positive words over their life and see you next Monday. This is life as we know it.